The influence of Bill Belichick still out there in New England. Our Patriots reporter Mike Reese, who's been all over this story, joins us live from Foxborough. No surprise, Gerard Mayo did not want to answer that question. However, what can you tell us about the approach that the Patriots are taking to get receiver Ayuk? See my expression when you said aggressive, because that's not something that you typically hear about the Patriots going after other players. But the Patriots, they'll make their preseason debut on Thursday night. How much do we expect to see from their rookie quarterback, Drake May? Bill Belichick was out there in New England. You probably surprised yourself, but a new era for this Patriots team. Mike Reese with the latest. Thanks so much. Our reporter Jeff Darlington is back here with us. And Jeff, <laughs> we have some new developments among QBs ahead of this week's slate of preseason action. Starting in Denver, who are you hearing is making the push for QB1? Well, this Surprise is... with Sam Darnold having the edge in that QB competition. It wouldn't be Darlington dishes unless we had some dishes, something to yes. spin. Oh, and of course, you, like, I'm, spin I'm trying, look, I'm trying, because Let's you know it. what, Jeff is just so talented. I, he does the whole laptop I thing. just spin objects. Look at me, look at, look yeah. at this, look no, at I, this. Okay. That's okay though. Look, I got, I got to take I lessons see, from actually, Jeff. Actually, basketball is tougher than, uh, look, look at than, this. He's than still anything going. like square. Jeff is still yeah. going. This I'm is much look. easier than basketball. We now welcome in our betting analyst, Aaron Dolan, here with us right now to take a look at some early plays. And there's certainly big expectations in Green Bay with George Love, but also big expectations for Chicago Bears QB, Caleb Williams. How should betters look at the Bears' chances of making the playoffs? So I'm looking at the Bears to miss the playoffs. Now we can see both sides here are minus 110. And in this market of all the teams right now that are available, to make the playoffs is the most bet on thing. The second most bet on thing is going to be to miss the playoffs. So I agree with the public in terms of missing the playoffs because although the hype is all around Caleb Williams, rightfully get over so. the hump and make it to the postseason. Obviously, I, I'm excited for them. Everyone's excited to be talking about the Bears and I'm excited to watch Caleb Williams, but I do think ultimately they will miss the playoffs. Yeah, history not on the side of the Chicago Bears. They've missed the playoffs in the last three straight seasons. Well, staying in the NFC, 49ers in the headlines today with the news about Brandon and IU, but another team also in their division getting some buzz. What do you make of the Rams' chances of, re of reaching the postseason? So I'm going to take the Rams to make the playoffs. Now, a lot mm -hmm. of times in these markets, and every market when we're handicapping it, you're thinking about coaching experience, and Sean McVay has been great, okay? He's made the postseason in five of seven seasons that he's been the head coach of the Rams, not to mention having at least nine wild card loss to Detroit last season after winning seven of their last eight regular season games just a year ago. Aaron Dolan always making us smarter. <laughs> Thanks so much.